welcome back to Sonata Ultimate Ninja, and today, guys, um, I guess you already seen because already people have already written me about it. <laughs> but um, Hidan Blood Possession is here. Uh, Blood Possession Hidan or whatever that's that whatever that stuff is. Death Possession. There you go. Death Possession. That's what I meant. There you go. Um, so I'm just gonna do this video today. I mean, uh, I was gonna do. I would. It would be longer, but um, Sakura. Um, I don't have her, so her eight gates has actually been revealed. So I guess uh, whenever I get her, I will do that. But I can't do it right now, so that's the thing. So let's go ahead and look at him. He's a defender, which is awesome. Great having defenders in here. All right, so let's take a look at him. So, uh, okay, he has the Akatsuki, Olusha Mario Akatsuki Nagato, Kisame Samahata Fusion, Naruto Four Tails. Kakazu and Kakashi Komori. Okay, it's not so bad. It's not so bad. I can see that. All right, so let's take a look at his thing. That look, that picture looks sadistic as hell. So spinning sight is the first one. Inflicts 170% plus 35 damage to a single enemy unit, increasing 50% of defense and 30% of Ogi resist for two rounds when getting hit. Wait. Oh no, when getting hit, there is a 40% chance to drop all damage taken by 50%. Wowzers. With such small text, that's pretty good. To drop all damage taken. What's, how is that different from what... From what, what's his name does, uh, Itachi Susano. Besides it being more. To drop all damage taken by 50%. Okay. That already that's pretty freaking good. Increasing 50% of your defense. So you can hit so you just get it. Increasing 50% of defense and 30% of Ogi resist. So 30% damage for, uh, against your ultimates, okay. For two rounds. And when getting hit, there is a 40. Okay, that's already great. Amazing. Jesus Christ. It's awesome. Okay. Uh, wow, that's a lot for a fucking tank. Inflicts 390% plus 48 points of damage to a single enemy unit. Get, get, death possession blood, increasing 20% of damage rate, 20% of damage reduction, and 20% attack, lasting for two rounds, each time taking critical hit. Each time taking critical hit recovery, extra 100 points of rage. I'm guessing getting hit, you hit with a crit, you will recover 100 rage, okay. And drops targets damage rate and damage reduction by 15%. Okay, so every time you get hit with a crit, it weakens them. That's pretty interesting. That actually might not be so bad. Considering that he already can drop all a lot of the damage taken, so if he gets hit with the crit and drops 50% of the damage, that's actually pretty good then. Uh, when unleashing Ogi, so his ultimate, randomly disperse negative effect on one ally ninja and increase all ally unit control resist by 10%. Each one mountain curse seal increases effect by 10% up to 60% of control resist. Okay, I don't think, I mean, this is, I mean, it's control resist is pretty good, but you don't need to have a bunch of mountains curse seal. But the fact that, like, this right here is pretty good. Like, get death possession blood, increasing 20% of damage rate, 20% of damage reduction. And 20% attack lasting for two rounds off of the person you hit. It's awesome. Those are all great numbers. Each time taking critical hit recovery extra wage. I mean, like I said, taking critical hits aren't so bad if you can reduce it in some way. And it seems like you have a 40% chance to do that. And it probably gets better uh, uh, with your. It probably gets better with your whole kit. You know, like your your, your I mean, uh, your um. Eight gates, so your eight gates probably makes the number better, I'm guessing. So you'll probably get it off more often, is what I'm guessing. Uh, it's, it sounds amazing though. That's 
That's crazy. And then, uh, says when unleashing Ogi, oh wait, and drops the target's damage rate by and damage reduction by 15% when getting hit by a critical. This is nice because something hitting you and doing extra damage was nice that it actually weakens them. So it could something for it's like a bonus for you for them hit critting you basically so and you get 50 percent defense on your uh, first ability which is still a lot of defense yeah this whole thing sounds great i think that sounds awesome also curse ritual is a possess is a passive increase one's own eight percent of damage reduction and 25 percent of crit resist and 35 percent block rate jesus the first round guarantees to unleash minor skill for first death okay oh no i'm sorry it's period there so okay so you guarantee to get your first skill the first round okay for first death immediately enter revive state inherent 50 percent hp and a hundred percent chakra only triggers once per battle if friendly if friendly side has four and more about four and more or or more okay Ca uh, mountain curse seals increase all uh, uh, all friendly unit ultimate resist damage reduction by 50% for two rounds dude he's gonna be a good tank the fact that you get a permanent revive with 50% of your health and a hundred percent chakra means you come back and ult immediately so it's like Ochimaru Akatsuki's re revive if it was permanent. That's pretty good. 8% damage reduction is awesome because it's damage reduction and not just damage like defense. Um, 25% crit resist, which isn't amazing for crit resist, but I mean, it, since you want them to kind of crit you, not so bad. And 35% block rate, which is also pretty high for block rate. The first round, okay, so you cast your skill, so you get that 50% right off the bat. For first death, immediately enter revive state now I guess the only thing that would be different is like uh, like for him compared to other defense is what this means a chance to drop all damage taken by 50% there's a 40% chance to do it my 50% let me see something because no one says drop all damage taken I'm guessing that's a whole number and just minusing but what's that difference what what's the difference between that and like to negate what's the difference between that and negating damage upon being attacked Hmm. There is a 61.4% chance to Okay, I mean, 61 for 4 isn't so bad. I mean, let me see. Um, Obito. I'm trying to look for Obito. Did I pass him already? I'm stupid like that. I might have. I might have. Dude, am I bl- oh, there he is. I was about to say, dude, am I blind? Okay, um... And during the battle, there is a 47.5% chance to reduce 44.4% direct damage. Um, when other ninjas die, can recover- okay. To re- to reduce direct damage, I just- God, there's got to be a difference between all of them. I just don't know it, so I I can't tell you guys. No idea. But um, 
yeah, there you go, guys. That's pretty much it. I got nothing else. Um, I got Ambu Itachi's weapon, if that mattered at all, or, uh, you know, because uh, I was able to do the event. So, you know, well, Raven. Uh, I got it because I did uh, this event right here, the Fate Divining. It gave me a bunch of numbers and everything. Um, and seven. It gave me a bunch of numbers, like, and I got super unlucky this time because I hit it quite a few times. I uh, got a bunch of these, though, and they were able to give me a uh, hundred so I could synthesize the weapon. And then I used uh, some of these. Uh, the, 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 where is it? This right here. A uh, special discount. And I bought the ones up here. There. This one. And this one. And it gave me it all, so. There you go. Oh, I got it. But, um, yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed, though. When he comes out, I'll definitely get him. Uh, I just don't know when he's coming out. But, I mean, he looks awesome. And I think he's going to be a great defense. I might actually put him in replace of Obito. But it all depends on what his first skill does, what that means. if What it means to drop all damage taken. So I'm not sure what that means. But, you know, when, we, when he comes out, I'll, I'll take a look at him. And we'll see if we can figure out what that means. But, yeah, guys, I love you, though. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.